Oh, it's here. It's it's here. It's here. It being me. Oh yeah, that, you know, I could call myself it, I suppose. Probably. Well, no, people don't call me it. The, the, the four-letter word begins with C. That's what I'm known as. Anyway, Rod here. Futures 8-bit again. Um, five random games on the C64. C64C uh, with a SD2 IEC and an epic fast load to speed things along. Obviously available from my store. You wouldn't use somebody else's kit. You're going to use your own, especially when it's the best kit, you know? Um, anyway, so yeah, five random games have had a bit of success um, with things loading, which is nice. Um, yeah, um, and I, I've just played... Um, Break the illusion, I'm afraid. I've recently just played Beachhead on the Spectrum for the first time ever, which was... Uh, it was it was a good game, but I played it on easy, and I think that ruined it. So anyway, so now we're going to play Stranded. Just checking, we've got five games there. One, two, three, four, five. Stranded is the first one here, then. So here we go. Look how easily this is going to load. Dun, 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 dun. Done. There we go. <laughs> I was just looking at the screen and going, oh, is that loading? Anyway. Okay. Don't be a text adventure. Oh, you bummer. And I've used the word bummer. You shouldn't use that word these days. Bottomer. There we go. Um, brown. <laughs> what can I say? You are standing in a brown plateau... Uh, the brown landscape seems to be devoid of colour, but has brown. Uh, exits lead south, east, and west. You can see brown. Right, so we're, interestingly, there's no north. There's normally always a north. We can, so we're going to go south. And I'm using the correct keyboard. I'm liking the drawing. That's a nice bit of orange. How does it look over there? Dirty. Should probably change the uh, colour levels. The capture on the C64, because yeah, it's a bit washed out. Anyway, it's down on the edge of a steep cliff. Oh, look out, cliff. Um, in the distance, you can see a spaceship. Right, so we've gone south, and that means we can see the spaceship, but then we can only go north again. Uh, right, so now we're going to go west, young man. What have we got here? Hmm. Uh, you are on a rocky mountain path. Exits lead north and east. Right, so you can see a fuel capsule. Oh, right, get fuel. Okay, good. Um, so we've just come west, so now we're going to go north. Uh, you're on a rocky mountain path. Uh, down below you can see a canopy of trees. A uh, featureless desert stretches out across the brown horizon. Exits lead up and down. Mm. Oh, we're going to go up into the sky. You're in a no, 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 no. exits lead up and down. We're going to go down. We can't do that. Something's going wrong with the north and west, isn't it? South. What? Exits lead up and down. You see nothing. Yeah. South, west, north, up. Do we have to type? Oh. Well, there we go then. So it turns out this game can be crashed by typing U at. What can I say? Might be a lucky escape, to be honest. I was kind of slightly enjoying that. I mean, look, we've got several types of brown there, yeah? And like a little bit of walnut whippy. And by the way, walnut whips have ruined. Don't buy like I did all of the walnut whips because they're all rubbish now. Every single one of them. Right. Anyway, enough to talk about walnut whips or walnut whips. Uh, okay. So that was the brown game. We're now going to load something that's going to be blues. Let's go for blues as we're on the 64. Mind you, that's more of a C16 thing, isn't it? Everything in blue. Right, if you don't know what the load, load the first program. Downloaded from c64hq.com. Does that still exist? Uh, 
Do you know, I didn't check a bloody audio level on this machine. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, Hellfire plus five. This is difficult for me to read. Not in 88. Fire button works. Blah. That's the sort of thing I'd have printed out back in the day and wasted a sheet of paper in black and white. Yeah, okay, a bit more of that. Well, just hellfire, wasn't it? Just to do it. No, cheating's for cheats. Starting level one, obviously. Right. Unreadable, 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 unreadable. Barry. Today's hot shots. Oh, hello. Okay, nice bit of brown there. Mm. Show me your brown. Oh, shoot me down. Yeah, hopefully that sound isn't... Is that things coming towards me? I don't know. Okay, I guess I'm shooting stuff. There seems to be green stuff coming up from the ground. Okay, there's a lot going on here. I can't see when they're shooting me though. I know they are, because I'm dying. And I'm playing this on the correct type of screen. This is what it would have been designed to be used on, and I can't really make out the enemy shots. I said shots. Oh, right, that's me shooting the ground. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, you learn something new every day. Pretty enough though, isn't it? Whoop, 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 whoop. I'm scared I'm gonna hit the ground. Is there an altitude thing? It's where you need one of your buddies in the room to tell you what the hell's going on with the rest of the screen. Ah Heads up. Online. Brown. Brown. The world of brown. Yeah, I, I definitely haven't seen this, you know, it's another, I, I had a Commodore 1 to in my life for a very long time, I have an awful lot of games, never seen this one before. Is this the next level? Slightly different colours at the top. No. Da, 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 da. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, actually, if you if you look at the stuff at the bottom for any length of time, your brain does sort of uh, collapse in on itself. Am I not dead yet? <laughs> you know a game's good when you're waiting to die. Really wish I did game reviews back in the day. In the honest game reviews would be, you know, what, well, one in ten games in the top ten are worth buying? It's a lot of the time we just buy what was available. I'm not saying that there weren't quite a few games, but there's an awful lot of trash. This, this is middling, this is alright though. I think if you bought this, you would have um, stuck it out for longer than I'm about to. Hang on. He fires automatically. So, the fire that I'm doing must be nothing more than dropping the bombs. Well, again, there was instructions in the crack and obviously I didn't read them, so it's my own fault. Right, so yeah, firing must be the bombs. Because that's why everything was blowing up on the ground. Those things are still blowing up on the ground. I don't know. So all you've got to try and do then is lock on. Alright, so it's a lock on time. Look, we're locking on. It's alright when you know what you've got to do. <laughs> Here we are. Figured it out. <sighs> As a kid, that wouldn't have annoyed you at all, would it? Oh my! 
This level's called Assault on the Eyes. And I think I'm out of things now. Alright, we we'll have to give that another quick go just in case. That font's out of place, isn't it? Yeah, give this another go just in case I actually speed this along now and know what I'm doing. So I've definitely got the bombs. Ah, not you, you have bombs. <laughs> With these bombs, you are spoiling us. Brown, 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 brown. Yeah. Oh. I might press fire as well. Right, so there's a lock on thing. That's definitely a thing. We've done that. We've established the lock on thing. And I keep going down. Oh, Oh, hello. Don't know what that was. Maybe it was important. Oh, you. Okay, so when it goes bling, maybe I'm supposed to press fire and launch a rocket. Yeah, maybe. I think it's a bit of both. You got ploppy plop weapons. Woo. And then you also can press fire when it goes square. There we go. Look, so it's a little bit. There's some skill going on here. Unfortunately, not not from me. All ah, right, don't collect that. That was bad. So yeah, when when it goes kajing, you can lock. Of that, you, other than that, you've just got your normal pop pops. Alright, okay, let's see, we've got four lives to get up past this. God, this is slow, look at it. Ooh, day three, eh? Oh! I didn't realise I had done two levels on, or two waves, I suppose. Two waves. Yeah, I've got some uh, other videos still to come up. Got, uh, the secret stuff that I've been working on for ages. That you can't see until it's ready, and that's how we roll. And then I've got some stuff that I did as a follow up to a very short video that was totally pointless, to a slightly longer video that's mostly pointless. Um, both of those require editing. It's when it's, it's when it needs. It's one is the upload because my broadband here is not brilliant because I'm a long way from the box. Um, uh, but yeah, the other thing is when there's anything that actually needs a bit of care and editing. Who, you know, I need to go to a different room for that to use my better computer. And that means I only do one thing, and I can't do one thing, I've got There's always too many other things to get done in a weekend, you know. Anyway, I think we're enough of World of Brown. We'll just see if we've got one life left. I mean, this is alright. I think, I think you can get into this, and I think you could probably enjoy this by getting good at it. The landscape is a bit troublesome. But, you know, silly me. He's in the zone. Words. Hey. So it's traditional, look, you can run out of lives, you get onto the next stage. Classic. Yeah, I hope the uh, garish pictures on the side of the screen aren't too annoying for all you people. Obviously it's me uh, doing a sideways shit of the stuff that, you know, I'm known for. But uh, yeah, so SD2 might be seen, uh, fast load, or Kung Fu Flash, if that's the way you want to go. Really good if you've got CRT files. Um, if you're a bit of a novice to the C64, actually, it's a good way of getting into it via CRT files, you don't have to think too much, you just load them. Um, where an SD2 is obviously more for disc-based things. But Kung Fu will also do disc. Um, but yeah. So that was World of Brown. So that was Hellfire. Man, I played that too long. So we've got Baloo. Balloon. Balloon.
Clonk. Ah, my eyes. Balloon Hunter. Oh, yeah. Something we used to do in the 80s got hunting wild balloons. Terrible. Unlimited lives. No. Oh, no. No. Okay, there he the moon hunter. Oh, hello. <gasps> okay. I'm um, I'm assuming balloon doesn't mean balloon. I keep falling into these holes or dying. This is fantastic. What are you? Are you a balloon? No, I am a spider. Okay. I think I've just accidentally found the best game. Are you endangered? Good. Can I... I don't know if I killed you. Are you endangered? You are. You're a mushroom. Aww. This is weird. Where's the balloons? I'm going hunting. Let me go down this green, green field. Grass. Nothing else on it. It appears you can't shoot anything, so I'm literally just going to go for a bit of a walk. Weird. Oh, I got him. Oh, I got him. Alright, so you can... So this is basically just hunt... That's the snake! <laughs> so, some stuff you can easily kill. So the mushrooms you can kill, and that's okay. We don't mind killing mushrooms, because remember the nuisance? There was a plague of mushrooms in 1984, and everything in the UK was covered in mushrooms. Um, yeah, we all remember it well. There was a thing on uh, Blue Peter on about how to uh, use up the mushrooms, and make Christmas decorations out of them, that sort of thing. Ah, you bummer. Stop saying bummer. No, so th ah, maybe I should grab. I should have grabbed the balloon. Game complete. All right, so we've done that level. We didn't catch the balloon. There was a balloon. I tried shooting it. It didn't pop. Don't know why I can't kill the spiders. Surely you want to kill the spiders because people are scared of spiders. Ah, just takes a lot of shots. I said shots. Show me a balloon. There's a balloon. Give. I grabbed the balloon and I think I got 1,000 points. I am a balloon keeper, not hunter. Are you... We get rare, rare animals are the best ones to kill. That's why you get these doctors going to kill things in the Africas. And then tweet about it, or Facebook it, and then find out the world thinks that they're a cock. Weird that, isn't it? Right. Okay, Balloon Hunter. Not really the name I'd call that. Um, but yeah, it was alright. It had a nice use of green. We like green. Probably not the review that they would have wanted, but there we are. Okay, Vortex 19XEX. So far, so good on these loading as well, which is nice. I mean, these, seriously, none of these games have ever been tested by me. <gasps> what is. Blimey! Can I slow down, please? Thank you. No. No. Definitely novice. Expert must be hell on toast. Oh. I don't know if I'm supposed to shoot that or not. There was a game, I can't remember what it's called now, where you had to protect the thing in the middle and not let it have holes in it. Oh, don't hit the edge of the screen. Is that a thing? No, oh, I didn't do that. 
I'm lost. There I am. There I am. I seem to, I'm safer over here, wherever that is. It's like the British Standard Kite Mark game, isn't it? I guess that's the thing again now. Has everything got to be British Standard and public information films now we've left civilization? Well, now I've slowed it down enough to make it nearly playable. Quite enjoying it. I don't know though if I'm supposed to just nibble away at this thing and shoot the dot in the middle. I mean, that could be the aim of the game, could it? Can I slow down, please? Ow. All right, we're going to try expert now. I think that's harder to shoot. I think the aim of the game is actually to shoot the dot in the middle of there, right? So we're going to die and then have another go on easy. Novice. <laughs> Did press there again. That is the noise that the plant made on the adventure game. For all those cool kids playing along at home. Again, I think this is a game that could deserve a, a, a bit of a, a neat little remake. This actually plays okay. It's got some weird slowy downy speed uppy things, but again, I can't program, so I should shut my face. Um, I can do soldering and staying up very, very late at night. That helps. That's basically my super skill. I appear to be able to turn around on the dot. I'll make stupid noises. Got it by just going straight for it. Look at that. Ooh, blimey. Oh, blimey. Mm, colour change. Mm, hello. We love it to colour change, don't we, boys and girls? Right, okay. Vortex is clearly good, but I'm clearly crap. Okay, next game. Right, so we're going to get. So this will literally be 15 games in a row. <gasps> he didn't load them all on all these different machines in one go. Yes, he did. Sorry. Um, that's not true. I did the uh, Spectrum one last night. And then the Big 21, shortly before this video. <gasps> what? 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 Uh, games people play. I wasn't even paying attention. This looks like that game that people like. But this doesn't appear to be the version I'm familiar with. Oh, yeah. Xylagon. Xylagoon? Maybe, yeah, because there was... Uh, this isn't the original, is it? This is somebody else's hash of it. Fly over that. I hate these barrier things. As a kid, I think your brain is, is better to deal with things that you have to imagine are correct. As an adult, your brain just goes, No, wrong! And then you can't comply. Time and fuel waits for no man. Blue. Oh, blimey. I was looking at the other screen. Skill 4.
pink, green. Okay. Oh. Apparently I'm in skill two now. Whoop. Oh, this is rather confusing. Are they fuel? That's what I'm wondering, you see. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Oh, <laughs> I'm high enough to fly over those anyway. Well, well, well. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. The perspective thing isn't doing great for my mind. There's a hell of a chunky graphics they're using here. Because it was Zaxxon and that, wasn't it? The other one? Super. That's it. Superb Zaxxon. None of the ordinary Zaxxon. Oh, well, no. This is better. Huh? This is a better game. We'll just play this, thanks. Just this. Nothing else. Shark attack. Shark attack. In your face. It's in your face. Interesting dynamics here. Base, and by interest, I mean this is an arse. Because obviously I'm still on that track, but... They've changed a few busy bobbies. I've got a high score. Well, I'm enjoying this more than the other level, actually. Brown. Right, so we've done that bit, and now we get go to, to smash into walls. Uh, well, that's not bad. Xylog is that two? Is that three O's or is that a G? Log on, Xylagoon. Oh, it's in the, I'm reading it in small, and it's smack in the middle. Use choice. That's eh, not a bad little game. Anyway, that's me. Don't doing my five games. I hope you um enjoy these videos i hope you visit the website and uh you know spend all of the kids college money um grandma's pension anything really um yeah i i need money for for speed boats and space travel and um jelly so if you could sort that out please until the next time